Tonight, a Little Rock woman waiting for a life-saving bone marrow transplant. I'm just going to stay positive and that I will find a donor. And although doctors say this could be a long shot, Fox 16 Susan L. Corey shows us how she's getting a lot of help from some lifelong friends. Susan. Yeah, Donna, doctors told Tanya Courtney Nichols that the odds of her finding a bone marrow donor are slim. But you can see here that's not stopping her sorority sisters from doing everything they can to track that person down. Sisters stepping up. I never was expecting it. Rushing to one of their own side. <laughs> decades after sorority rush. I was not even accepting the diagnosis. Tanya Courtney Nichols has to keep visits to her house these days ever since finding out she had leukemia. I've had five rounds of chemotherapy since September. The 48-year-old wears a port where UAMS doctors give her daily blood transfusions, but all that isn't a cure. I need a bone marrow transplant, but right now there's no donor. That's where her Alpha Kappa Alpha sisters come in. We um, immediately went into mission mode. It started with a bone marrow drive at one of their Little Rock meetings. I really just um, pray that God has that donor out there for her. Without a match, they're looking at the bigger picture, planning another drive this month for anyone who's willing. It does not take very long, and um, it's a simple swab, and you could potentially save a life. The women say one of the biggest hurdles is out of their control. That it would be difficult to find um, for any ethnicity besides uh, Caucasian. Hoping for the best. I will find a donor. Even if it's just helping someone else in the same place. The trade-off is you save someone's life. The drive is set for Sunday, April 28th at St. Mark Baptist Church in Little Rock. You can find all details about the event, plus what it takes to be a donor, up on our website, fox16.com. Back to you.